you can own your home in the next two to three years. You can live in a space where you eat nothing but sustainable heirloom and organic foods, where you don't pay a light bill, where you don't pay a water bill, and you are surrounded in a community of people that you consider as your family. What I am talking about is a new way of being that we have developed called Freedom Nation. Now, about five years ago, myself as a senior elder of the Freedom Nation joined together with a set of like-minded individuals and created a system by which we could assist other people to achieve freedom in their life through a systematic process. I'd like to talk to you about that systematic process and how this life that we refer to as a life of free people or free folk can be yours. It also includes the ability to specialize in key areas that provide the essential needs that you need in your life, including automation and technology that otherwise can be used to earn a six-figure salary if you choose to go outside of your free environment and earn outwardly. It is the highest quality of life that can be achieved by an excellent individual. And it has been put together and fully funded by the senior elders and founders of Freedom Nation. Now, to get into it and explain to you exactly how the system works, I'll have to talk to you about our ranking system. At Freedom Nation, we use a ranking system within what we call the free folks. Those are crew members inside of the division of the Freedom Nation called Freedom Builders. Freedom Builders is specifically designed to build free environments for free folks first and secondarily for all those other individuals choosing to live in a free, self-sustainable community that is close-knit as family. When you first come and make up your mind that you have the internal fortitude and the overall dedication to work and you come to the realization that you can change your life yourself, we start you out as a recruit. You become a recruit by signing up for the Free Folks Self-Sustainability Bootcamp that is held here at Freedom Labs inside of Atlanta, Georgia at our Recruitment and Training and Processing Center. Right now, I'm standing inside of a project that was just finished a couple days ago by our Alpha One Bootcamp crew. If you see behind me, there's a brick wall. You can see the top of the wall, not the entire thing, but this is the base for a countertop, as well as the brick wall that the camera's on and everything else around me has been built by that single Free Folk crew within less than three weeks. Now, let me define what I mean as far as built. When I say built, I mean this brick was dirt in the ground less than three weeks ago. And now it is a well-built, solid wall. If you notice the Free Folks logo that's on my left chest, it has two wings that symbolizes freedom, a shield, which means something that we're willing to work for and protect, and do not underestimate the two shovels. Two shovels because free folks dig. We dig because in the earth, we know that there are all the resources we need to live a perfect life. Here at the Free Folks Training Camp, we mill wood, we dig in the ground and make brick, and soon we'll be making glass. We also do woodworking, we make all of our cabinets, and everything else that will go in the home, including wood flooring, joist beams, roofing systems, and the like. Now, to show up is to become a recruit, but to actually complete the boot camp, that is, that you complete the overall production challenge, which is 500 bricks a day with your crew members, that you've learned how to work, how to be efficient, how to rely on yourself and how to be the kind of person that once you say something will get done, 
it absolutely gets done. When you've proven that to yourself and your fellow crew members, we then award you the right of a crew member. Now, a crew member in the Free Folks is very unique because the Free Folks is limited to having only 50 members at any given time on a specific continent. That means that in North America, there will never be more than 50 Free Folk at any given time that are crew members or above. They have either two, in, two straight lines insignia, one for being a recruit, the second for completing the boot camp. Once they get that status, the very next thing they do is to move on to our 500 acre village, currently in Hancock County. That's about an hour and 20 minutes from Atlanta and about 45 minutes from Augusta, Macon, Athens, and two hours from the port in Savannah. They go there, if you're in North America, in order to be given the land that they will build their house on. I want to be really clear with what I said because there are some of you who will think I didn't say it because it's an amazing thing to give. We will give you the land that you need to build your house with your Free Folk crew members. And the first thing you do out of the six week boot camp is go and build your own home. Not another project, not for anyone else, but your house. We want to make sure that you're stable. We want to make sure that that big thing that people sometimes work the majority of their life to achieve is achieved by you so it's no longer a worry for you. Once you successfully build your home with your Free Folk crew members, we then move you up to the level of senior crew member. Now, a senior crew member has three bars, and this starts on an entire new journey. At this point, it's to recognize that the senior crew member has completed their own home and is a permanent resident of the Freedom Village and is living a completely free lifestyle. Now, you're probably asking during this time, how were you able to eat? How were you able to do basic things? Some of you will ask, how was I able to earn money? Well, I'm going to ask you as part of this system to think a little bit out of the box. We earn money in order to pay our bills. We earn money in order to save up for things we want to do in our future. If you are a free folk, your future is capsulized inside the system that you are working on, that you are developing and the future you're creating with your crew. As far as your daily expenses, well, that's what I'm here for. Senior elders, and we'll get to that in the ranking system, have a very unique position inside the Freedom Nation. They provide the ability for people who come through the free folks to focus holistically on building up their life the way that they desire. Now, after becoming a crew member, you start working on your specialization. Specialization falls into six key areas. The it's actually seven, but you cover one as being a free folk. The first one is infrastructure development. You start that from day one in the boot camp, and you will continue to grow your ability to build actual buildings that provide comfortable lifestyles for the people who operate within them. Secondarily, you'll then learn how to work on food systems. These are the specialties. In order to move to the next level, you only have to specialize in one. That is food systems, water purification, energy production and generation, animal husbandry, mechanics, and automation. Now, let's take automation as an example. In an automation specialist situation, you will have completed your home, you will be there with your family inside of Freedom Village, and now you'll have to reach out to our Freedom Masters in order to achieve this specialization. One of our Freedom Masters inside the automation set is a gentleman by the name of Jonathan Buford. I mention his name because he's someone I will always respect and the free folks will always hold to the highest level because he is an individual who has proven that he has excellence in his ability to work in his field of mastery, which is hardware automation design and development. You will fly to his home in Hong Kong and work with him in order to learn the skills necessary to become a hardware automation master, specialist, I should say. 
Secondarily, you'll come back and you'll work with Mukhtar Jugger. That is one of our senior elders that has focused his life on building software. The two, hardware development, software development, and being able to put them together to create controls and systems that actually automate all the things that we do inside of the Freedom Village and anywhere in our space is what it takes to become an automation specialist. Like I said, it's one of six that you can specialize in, but once you achieve it, you achieve a star above your ranking. That star signifies that you are a specialist in at least one of the six key and essential life areas. After you receive this star, you're in a whole nother world. Some people will choose to stop. They'll choose to take that skill, go and monetize it either through working with the Freedom Village to develop products that they can sell to the world as well as within the village, and they will retain a good life. That's a path that you can get to within about three years, four years if you extend it beyond when it needs to be extended. But if you choose to continue with your crew, the life changes dramatically because now you start going on deployments. Your crew of five is specialized to go out and build entire environments by yourself. And we've done a lot of work in this area. Right now, we currently are negotiating Freedom Villages throughout Africa and Eastern Europe. And we're also working to develop deals inside South America. When I say deals, I mean we have to buy the land, put the equipment on the ground, make everything available for our crew members to go there. This is one of the key things that senior elders do in order to fund the Freedom Nation and ensure the engine continues to move and that those motivated people like yourself can continue to build. Moving forward, once you've completed a project and now gotten to a very special place, and that is where your personal ability has to be met with your crew member's approval to give you the second star which makes you a team captain. It's your crew members telling you that you are a leader, someone they recognize that has the ability to lead the crew to bring the best out of them and who always shows the best out of themselves. Captains can go on to lead entire crews and then reach for the next level of mastery, which is to become a master builder. Now a master builder circles back around to the specialist area and they become specialized in all six areas. To mention them again, it starts out with the infrastructure and building, that's number seven, that's a given to being a free folk. The second is food systems, water purification, animal husbandry, mechanics, automation, and energy. Energy production, energy storage, and creating smart distribution grids which is the heart of how we power the Freedom Village. Once they achieve all six of the specialist areas, the master builder is then qualified to lead an entire Freedom Village development. And this is where it gets really interesting because as senior elders in the Freedom Nation, we then go out and negotiate from a political standpoint and an economical standpoint an entire development that that master builder will help to design, create, and work with crews to build from the ground all the way up. And once he's achieved this awesome goal, he can then move on to the position of elder. And as an elder, he then runs a freedom village. Now by run a freedom village, we don't mean being a dictator. That is not something that is part of our structure. We mean a service leader someone who serves the people in order to ensure their freedom is maintained. That means the systems work, that people do the things that they're supposed to do according to the internal laws by which we govern ourselves. Things like having a good sense of doing the right thing in order to ensure freedom for everyone. Also, that person ensures that the Freedom Village continues on a growth path that will help it to grow into a modern, beautiful society that can become a model for everyone in that space. Last but not least, we have the position of senior elder. Now, I told you we get here, and a senior elder, I can tell you there will never be more than about two to three, maximum five senior elders 
in the world of the Freedom Nation. That's why these individuals are people who have given up everything in their life. When I say that, I mean that I literally have not a single dime to my name or a single ounce of effort that is not returned and vested into the Freedom Nation to ensure that this system can go on for a very long time and continue to facilitate people that, like yourself, are absolutely committed, absolutely committed to your own freedom and willing to work hard for it. This is the system that we've developed at Freedom Nation. We're inviting you to come and join us. I'm asking you to look on our website and go register first at freedomnation.me slash apply. That creates a citizen profile and it gives you a link where you can then set up a meeting to talk to me or other senior elders about your intentions, your goals, and things that you want to do in your life. And we can then talk on how this system can help you. The next step will be to register for our boot camp. From there, it's a clear and smooth ride to a system of freedom. I look forward to seeing you, look forward to meeting you. This is the Freedom Nation. I hope you join us.